Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am so excited that you're here today. You guys do not want to miss this video because I have a huge farmhouse Amazon haul for you guys, plus a few little items that I grabbed that have been really helpful around the house that I wanted to share with you guys. So if that's something you're interested in, I would love if you would stick around and let's jump right into today's video. Okay, so I don't have any system to show you guys. I'm just gonna grab at random. These are all things that I bought to decorate my home with um, that I thought were pretty affordable. You guys know how Amazon is. So some things are like hit or miss and sometimes you do have to search other places to find them cheaper. So you just have to decide, is the extra money worth getting it a few days sooner so anyway let's not waste any time let's jump right in um the first item that i picked up a lot of you guys um are new so if you're new we just recently bought this house in january we renovated the entire thing and we moved in end of march um uh, beginning of april so I'm still getting things to decorate with and, you know, put up on the walls, etc. So this was one of those things. I also want to preface by saying that I did not open most of these items. I like open the boxes just so that it's easier during the haul. But I wanted to get my knee jerk reaction right in front of you guys. So I did not open anything. So the first item I picked up, it's 100 pieces of dry plants. And I will say that I'm a little surprised. I thought these were gonna be a little bit different, but you know how the internet is. So it is like one bunch of wheat. And the directions were saying to like leave them out in the sun because through packaging and stuff, they get um, less fluffy. But if you leave them out in the sun for a couple hours, it says that it brings the fluff back to the artificial or to the dried, whatever you wanna call these, dried plants. <laughs> so um, I'm not really too sure what these are called. Uh, I guess this is another part of the wheat. And then these two are kind of in there together. These are like pampas grass. Y'all, I am like tripping right now. I did not expect these to get so full and fluffy. <gasps> okay, so if you get these, which I will link everything down below for you guys, but if you get these, stick them out in the sun for a couple hours, it works. Look how fluffy they were. When I got home and saw them, I was like, wow, I'm actually super impressed. So these are a 10 out of 10, definitely recommend. The next item I picked up is a clock. Now, I thought this was gonna be a little bit bigger of a clock. I got some farmhouse clocks from Walmart a few years back, and they're really good size at the same price. So, not really too sure. I also will pop up on the screen the prices of everything. I do know this one was $29.99, and it is a super gorgeous clock. Like, I love the way that it looks. It's real wood, and I love it. I think it's gorgeous. However, I don't know if it's $30. I don't know if it's worth $30. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Do you guys think this clock is worth $30? or do you feel that you can get something better for cheaper? I also picked up a lot of um, pillowcases and pillows, just because I don't have very many here um, that are like farmhousey. I do have the pillows that came with our couch, but I hate them. So I picked up several covers. So this one is the farmhouse pillow cover. And I think there's several in here. Because, you know, sometimes you don't receive what you ordered, if that makes sense. They are pretty. Oh, upside down. This one says, bless our nest.
So this came in a four pack. These all came together, just so you know. Why is there two? Oh, okay. Phew, I was about to say. Why is there two of the exact same thing? What the heck? <laughs> this one says home sweet home. So I'll have to iron these out and like put them in the cases for you guys. Look how gorgeous that is, you guys. <gasps> oh my goodness. Look at the detail. Love this one. Love, love it. Oh, this one's even better. Oh my goodness. I cannot handle it. Oh, I know you guys are going to freak over this one. I know you guys are going to freak over this one. Look how stinking gorgeous that is. Oh my goodness. I'm really, really excited about these. The next item I picked up, I feel like you can't ever have enough greenery. I pick up greenery everywhere I see it just because it's such a farmhouse staple that um, if you don't have greenery with your farmhouse decor, it doesn't really look like farmhouse. I don't know. But anyway, I picked up these 10 pieces, artificial eucalyptus leaves stems, and this is the way it comes packaged. So again, this is probably one of those things where you have to pull it out of the package, let it fluff up, let it get some air for it to be at its fullest potential, if you will. The heck? Oh, they don't want me to get into this. <laughs> Whoa. Y'all, this boy, he be kicking me and I'm like, whoa, what are you doing, bud? I'm telling you guys, boy and girl pregnancies are so different. Like I never realized how different it would be, but it's literally, everything is complete opposite from my girls. In fact, I pretty much knew it was a boy even before I had a positive pregnancy test, just because the week leading up to it was just so different. Anyway, I know that was random. Okay, so it comes with Five of these stems, they're gorgeous. I actually love those. I love the color, I love the shape. They look so realistic, way more realistic than the ones you can find at Walmart or you know, Dollar Tree or anything like that. So I love those. Then it also came with five eucalyptus picks. Now these are okay, they're not horrible. They're pretty much the same quality as I get at Walmart. So I'll have to break down the price to do like what would be half and half, if that makes sense, to see if like this is a good deal or not. But I think the quality is amazing. So for that reason, I will be keeping these. Okay, the next item that I picked up is also another pillowcase. Now this one is like a lumbar. doesn't really say on the sticker, but this one I had um, the thought of putting it on my bed. I have a video coming up here soon. Let me know down in the comments if you guys would like to see that, but I wanna do a master bedroom getting it all put together because little by little we've been adding things, but it's not done anywhere to my liking. So if you guys want to see a video on that, let me know down in the comments. <gasps> I love it. I love the truck and the greenery. So basically I did not even realize that this is pretty much the same version as that other truck one. This one is just in the lumbar pillow instead. So the truck didn't get cut off. Love it. Okay guys, editing me here. I know the lighting isn't very good, but I just wanted to mention, when I did this, I did not realize that the pillow that I ordered was not the pillow that I got. So the pillow that I ordered had the Buffalo check background and the one that I got did not. So it's not really a big deal to me, 
but you might just want to pay attention if you guys specifically want this for the buffalo check. Once you get it, make sure that it actually has it or return it. And I'm sorry I sound this way, you guys. We have been a little bit under the weather, so um, just bear with me. However, the show must go on, right? Okay, these are the last set of pillowcases that I picked up. I figured that I could just switch these out, even though um, th I have eight of them, I figured that I could switch them out every so often. And they're they're pretty much kind of the same style, just different designs. I love this watercolor image thing that they got going on. So this is pretty much kind of the same thing as that other one with the jar. However, this one says gather or yeah, this one says gather and it has the um, greenery and the jar with the cotton and the jute bow. Like I just thought that that was absolutely gorgeous and I had to have it. We have another saying, bless our home. Pretty much same thing. Um, again, just different, different wording, different font, I should say. And then the last two that came from that four pack, um, the last saying, quote unquote one, is stay a while, love that. And then last but not least of the four pack, this is another one of my favorites. Can you guys tell that I am a sucker for greenery? <laughs> I'm just a sucker, you guys. That color with my kitchen cabinets and I just, I just cannot pass it up when I see it. And I have a lot of these um, lamb's ear wreaths too. So I think that these are all gonna be absolutely amazing to keep um, out really all year round. Okay, so that is it for the pillowcases, you guys. Um, I absolutely love every single one of them. So let me know down in the comments which pillow is your favorite. Okay, the next item that I picked up, it says it is a farmhouse living, five and a half inches semicircle. And I do remember that this was $10.99. Look how cute that is. Now, honestly, you guys, it's not worth, this is not worth 11 bucks. This is probably gonna go back. Um, I don't know, I have it now, so maybe not, but I don't know. This is definitely not worth 11 bucks. I can show you guys how to make one of these for $1.25, and really you'd be making it for less because you only need a little piece of um, whatever we would use. So if you guys wanna see how to make this, let me know. I would love to bring that to you. Now this is wood, so that's probably why. You guys know wood is outrageous these days. But anyway, um, it's a lot smaller than I had anticipated and I know I can make it better. So I'll be sending that back probably. I don't know, we'll see. Let me show you guys a comparison, like on that wall, how small it is. So look how small that is. Like this is a pretty good size or pretty small wall. So I do like this like, I think they were trying to make this look like rust. I do really like that, but like I said, I can do it better. <laughs> oh, 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 oh my God, you guys. I'm really, really, really excited for this one. Bear with me, I gotta use the bathroom. Pregnancy, it never ends, you guys, never ends, but I'm grateful for it. I'm so excited to meet my boy. Also, if you guys have not subscribed, or hit that thumbs up or shared this video out and you're enjoying it, I would appreciate if you did that. I have a huge goal of hitting 100K by the time Mr. Man is born in October. So um, I'm really, really, really working really hard to get there. So if you guys could find it in your heart to share this out, hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I would greatly appreciate it. This is 10 pieces of farmhouse something sign 
farmhouse style. So basically that makes no sense. <laughs> basically what that means is it's 10 pieces of farmhouse decor for a tiered tray. And obviously you guys, I can make all this stuff myself, but sometimes we don't have the time to make it ourselves. And I also know that a lot of you guys um, just watch just to watch. You guys don't really truly DIY and you would much rather just buy your items instead of DIYing them, which is totally understandable and fine. So that's why I wanted to grab this to kind of show you guys. Um, I don't really know if it's any good, but I'm just gonna start grabbing. <gasps> Look how stinking cute. So there's one round with the animals. Here is one little house that says Farm Sweet Farm. That is so cute. <gasps> How funny is this, you guys? I did not do this on purpose. I honestly did not even pay attention to the colors of the beaded garland. <laughs> this is funny, look. Okay, so I think this is this cow is super cute. Not really too big of a fan of her bow. I'll probably change that out, no big deal. But look at this, you guys. <laughs> I just made a beaded garland like this on last video. So if you haven't seen that, where I um, redone a bunch of Michael's wood blank DIYs, plus a bonus DIY at the end, where I showed you guys how I made this gorgeous little beaded garland. So this is the one that I made which I feel is much better. <laughs> this is the one that I made, and this is the one that I bought. So you guys let me know, but I already know what you guys are gonna say, so. <laughs> okay, the next item in that little 10-piece set is a square that says, welcome to our farmhouse. And then this, I believe, is like a garland. I have to see if there's more. I'm pretty sure that, that it is. So it comes with a piece of jute and it comes with the windmills and you can see the holes. So we can string it together and they hang it on like the front of their tiered tray. But me personally, I've never done that. So I'm curious to see how that will look once I put it together. Okay, so this one says farm fresh, just something super simple. Super simple, black and white, love that. Now, I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see this very well, but. So, they, they gave me the banner, or it came with the banner that says farm, and then in between, I, I gotta look at the picture. I don't know if they have the windmills on either side of the F and the M, or if they have them in the middle, like, I'm pretty sure they put them on the end, but I'm not too sure. Anyway, thought that was super cute. These are the last items in the box. Y'all, this keto up. So delicious, burns your fat for fuel. It's a healthy Red Bull and puts your body into a state of ketosis instantly. If you guys want any ketone information, go down in the description box below. Friend request me on Facebook and send me a message that says ketones. That's how I lost 60 pounds in six months. And I would love to help you guys feel better again. So anyway, okay guys, we're getting down to the last few items. So this next item, I picked up for my laundry room and what it is, it's a laundry mat. So, or a laundry, I don't know, whatever. <laughs> laundry mat, but not the kind you go to and stick your clothes in the laundry mat. <laughs> like a mat that goes in front of your washer and dryer. Yeah, that's it. Oh God, help me y'all. Oh, this is really good size. Holy smokes, you guys. I don't even know if my arms, <laughs> I don't even know if my arms are long enough, dang. Oh God, I'm on the struggle bus. Look how gorgeous. Oh, I love this. I love, love this. 
So I picked up one of those. It says the Laundry Co. Wash, Dry, Fold, Repeat. The never ending cycle. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> I talk about that all the time. Okay, now one of the last items that I picked up is an eight by 10 Buffalo check rug. Originally, I don't know what I was thinking, you guys. I'm not very good at like visualizing measurements. So I should have gotten the five by seven because I wanted to put it in my other living room, but I ended up going with the eight by 10 thinking it wouldn't be big enough. I don't know, you guys, don't ask me. It ended up working out, so it's no big deal. I ended up taking everything out of this front room right here that I'm standing in, and I put together a little play spot for my kids. And this rug was literally perfect for this room. So it was meant to be, um, because it's so big, I'm gonna throw in a little clip here of what it looks like, and I'll also pop up the price for you guys. Okay guys, and last but not least, this is not a farmhouse item. That's why I kind of saved it for the end. But I'm at the point in my pregnancy where it's getting really, really hard to like bend over and like scrub stuff and clean. Um, I just have a big old belly in the way and then I feel like I can't breathe and it's a whole thing. So anyway, so I picked up one of these. It is a two in one cleaning brush kit tub bathroom tile scrubber and there's two types of refills so you can do the brush or you can do the scrubber and that's what i liked most about this particular one um as you guys know there's a bazillion quadrillion things on amazon so you really have to like scout read reviews um all that kind of stuff and this one had really good reviews and again, I liked that it came with two different heads. Obviously, you put the poles together. So I haven't tested this out yet. Um, I'll test it and let you guys know in this video, just because, you know, if the angle isn't right, if the pole isn't sturdy enough or whatever, then your item is not gonna clean very well. So I'm curious to test that out and I will let you guys know my verdict. Hey guys, so as I'm editing this video, this came in the mail finally. Um, you know, with the new house and everything, the kids, um, we have light carpet, and I already knew we were gonna get stains, no big deal, right? So I got on the hunt to look for like a stain remover, and the reviews on this were amazing. You guys, like I am, <laughs> highly highly impressed with this stuff hey guys sorry the lighting is terrible but i just wanted to show you guys real quick just for video purposes just to show you okay i've got red gatorade and i've got sophia's shirt so whoops i'm drinking i spilled some gatorade on my shirt whoops take your stain remover sorry guys doing the best i can with one hand Oh my God, are you kidding? I don't want it to get on my countertop. I'm gonna let that sit there for a minute. Can you guys believe that? Look at that. It's just disappearing. Like, oh my goodness, I can't.
Okay, you guys, that was it for this Amazon farmhouse haul. If you guys enjoyed this video, again, don't forget to show me the love, do all the youtube -y things. It really helps my channel to grow, and I do have a big goal of hitting 100K by the time my baby boy is born in October, and I cannot do that without your guys' help. Um, this was actually meant to be. I literally have to run out the door and head off to go see him. I have an appointment. So anyway, you guys, thank you for hanging out with me today. Don't forget to leave your favorite item down in the comments. Don't forget to let me know if you guys want to see how to make that half windmill. I would love to bring that to you. And as always, you guys, for ketone info, check the description box. Check the pinned comment. Um, it's all there for you guys. I do that in my spare time just to help you guys out. I remember what it feels like to feel heavy and not myself in monotone. You guys remember if you've been around. So anyway, I would love to help you guys. Anyway, that's besides the point. How many times can I say anyway? <laughs> I love you guys for sticking around with me. If nobody has told you today, please always remember you're absolutely gorgeous. You're worthy. You deserve everything you have coming to you. And just know that you can do anything you put your mind to. Hope you guys will stick around by clicking that red subscribe button. That way you don't miss an upload. I do DIYs once a week and hauls once or twice a week. So I'm around several times per week and I would love to have you guys a part of my crafty family. With all that being said, have an amazing day and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye. Check out the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload or join the DIY fam here to your right.